Power Rangers. Go, go, Power Rangers! Hello everybody and welcome to Ranger Chronicles. I am your host Charlie Niemeyer and once again we are on the Beast War first portion of the show. This is where we go and we watch the new episodes of Power Rangers Beast Morphers and release them as they or right after they air. I don't want to be a spoiler cast. We really don't have any preamble so I'm just going to go ahead and jump into the episode. This time out we are watching episode 19 Target Tower. And we are going to start that in three, two, one, go. There we are taking them outside. Just as blazing. Oh, good, it's picking up from last time. That's what happened when our memories were hacked. We had no idea we were stealing those transporters for E Fox. How many did he get? Three of the mega transporters. What's that? The stasis pod. Roxy! What's happening? The pod Someone circuitry the has thing. been overloaded. But how? By this. Ooh. Blaze and Roxy's handiwork. So, they did more than just take transporters. Is she gonna be okay? The pod's entire life support system is damaged. If she doesn't wake up soon, we may not be able to save her. What? No, there must be something more we can do. I'll try, but I'm not sure I can fix this. Ooh. You might not have to. If we destroy her avatar, then she'll wake up, right? That's right. Then that's what we gotta do. Whatever it takes. Let's go. Shouldn't Hold that on, have been the mission previously? Don't let your emotions cloud your judgment. But Roxy's in danger. While Evox has those mega transporters, everyone in the city is in danger. Technically, the You're world. Right, Commander. We have to figure out what Evox is planning. Scout the city, find those transporters. I'll bring Devin in. I'm afraid he's at his dad's re-election rally. You know, I was thinking of running for office myself. We know, we know. But robots aren't allowed. It's very unfair. Now, Duh. we need to get transporter hunting. <laughs> We're on it, Commander. Devin, do you copy? And that's I because in my family, that. we have the courage have I said that to do enough? what's right. That's how my son and I live our lives. And that's what I've always done for the city. Good to see the mayor again. We haven't I seen him for a while. I want to know that, like the Power Rangers, I'll make sure Coral Harbor is safe. Go Mayor Oh, is this a re-election? Oh, duh, they just... Thank you for your support. What are they looking for? Wearing these binocular goggles sure helps our search. Awesome idea, big sis. Yep, those stolen transporters have got to be around here somewhere. And with these Why? babies, we won't miss a thing. No, no, no. <laughs> Between us and the Rangers, nothing can get in our way. Explain to me again why they have to be around somewhere and who didn't see this coming. Hey, Einstein, your part's illegally. Well, they found them. Hey, those are our mega transporters. It's the old family luck. So is that, right? Oh, that was the old family curse. Let's get out of here. Call home. Quick, get pedaling faster, man. How do they fit all those things in that van? True leaders take courageous action in the face of a crisis. That's what I have always done. And if you re-elect me as mayor, that's what I'll continue to do. Ooh, what was he looking at? Ooh, lucky shot. Everybody, get to safety! Quickly! Tronics. Mr. Mayor, we need to get you to safety. The Power Rangers wouldn't leave until everyone was safe, and neither will we. Right, son? Devin. Devin! My own son. Well, what do you expect? Help! 
something else left. I miss anything? No sign of Roxy's avatar. The mega transporters are that way in a gray van. Great work, you two. Let's go. Oh. Bye. Oh, he kind of signaled to go before he said it. Oh, oh there's more. There's more. How many they got? Well, maybe they're transporting it. The van's over there. Squazzle, quick, teleport the Morphex Tower. I can't! All three mega transporters must be set up around the tower before we can activate them. And right now, they're in a van. And thanks to you clowns, the rangers are about to get them. What? Uh -huh. These products are useless. Usually. The rangers cannot get those transporters. We need a distraction. Send in a Giga Drone. What's the magic word? No! <laughs> Fine! Always saving your butts. Oh, is this going to be one of those end of the season kind of a throw in a few extra sword fights or something? Ooh! Nate's showing off. Let's get those transporters. Come on! Here we go! Yes! That's them! Commander, all three of the missing mega transporters are secure. How's Roxy? Her condition is getting worse. We're keeping a close eye on her. Son, getting those transporters back to base is your top priority. Don't stop for anything. Yes, ma'am. I'm on it. As for the rest of you, we've detected an incoming Giga Drone in Sector Echo 15. I'm deploying your Zords. Roger that, Commander. Let's head out. Seems the Rangers have beat you to it. There's Ranger not a the better way to get it there than just driving just it in the van. Base is oh, your what's priority. he gonna do? Don't stop for anything. If we destroy her avatar, then she'll wake up, right? <sighs> Sorry, Mom. This may be my only chance. Oh. <sighs> Enough! Woo! You're going down, Avatar. Sorry, little boy blue, but today is the last day for you and your girlfriend. It's about time for the intro, right? It's all dead. Is this the spot where, um, Dr. O and, what's her name, whose name escaped me, fought at the end of, uh, Dino Thunder? Which may or may not have been used in about eight other shows, but this one I'm remembering. The Giga Drone has landed. Let's do this, Cruz. You got it! Position. Possibly also where Trent fought the evil clone white ranger that season. That's the one I preferred to watch, and then I didn't watch any more of it that early, and I didn't watch much of the first one, so as far as the New Zealand stuff, you know. Get away from the tower, bobblehead! Let's rumble! So I wonder what monster this would be based off of since they haven't fought an actual, you know, regular. Whoa, it packs a punch. 
Mm, that might have been some wire work there. She's strong, but I can turn up the heat too. It's time to go eight. Oh, you're gonna overheat, dude. Blue Ranger's body temperature is rising fast. What? He's gonna overheat. He's supposed to be driving. Why is he heating up? Robbie. Come in, Robbie. Like he's gonna answer you the fight. Come See on, Mom. Take my gorilla strength. No! My morpher! Ooh. You're not teleporting out of this one. Hang on! Kevin, we can't take much more! We've got a mega sword. Let's finish this! And two other swords. Transport! Cheat a beast blaster! Or Cheetah Hyper Strike! That worked. I mean, it damaged a good chunk of the city there with the explosion, Probably. Eliminated. She is good at her own stunts. Is he gonna save Zoe? No, that's not Zoe. Oh, good timing on the sprinklers. I did it. I finally destroyed her avatar. I've saved you, Roxy. He did save Roxy. Huh? But the van's gone. No! No! Blaze has a mega transporters. Uh. Uh. You're gonna be in trouble. How could you allow Roxy to be destroyed? One of my lieutenants erased forever like cheap malware. But you still have me. Now. Scrozzle and I have calculated the position of the last transport scanner, and once the Tronics have put them all in place, you will get your tower full of Morphex. See to it, or disappointing me. It's definitely looking will like be the their plan might work now. You do. Roxy, what? It didn't work. I destroyed her avatar. Why didn't she wake up? I'm sorry, Ravi. I just don't know. Ravi. She dead. Get out here now. Oh. You are in trouble, Blue. You disobeyed a direct order. You put Roxy ahead of the entire city. If Coral Harbor is destroyed because Evox has those mega transporters, it'll be on me. I know, and I'm sorry. I should have brought the transporters straight back here. I'm sorry too. About Roxy. Thanks, Mom. Aww. Incoming call. Guys, she does have a tiny what? little bit of a heart. Ben and I found one of the transporters. Hey, it's Sector Foxtrot 37. There's a tower there. Evox must be trying to steal it. Go. Yeah, it's a shame they don't have like teleport technology. Pretty well hidden. It's directed at the Morphex Tower. The other two transporters must be hidden around the tower. We need to find them. Devin. Oh, uh. Hey, Dad. Don't oh. hate Dad, me. You didn't answer any of my calls or my texts. I am deeply, deeply disappointed in you. You ran away when people needed your help. That's not the young man I raised you to be. You're out until all hours. You won't find a job. 
You come back bruised and battered like you've been fighting? I feel like I don't even know you anymore. Dad, I... Another attack! Devin, go straight home! This acting it's isn't matching the voice that he's using. Emotion. It's time to put our plan in motion. Guys, it is critical that you get the mega transporter back to the base. We can't let Blaze get it. You can count on us. Good. Ben! Let's get to the car! That way! Quick, Betty! Oh. Oh. I don't like this! Hang on, little bro. Dad's gonna save the day. Uh. <laughs> Thanks, Mr. Mayor! You sure got my vote, huh? Are you old enough to vote? Go dead! Hey, there's groceries! It worked! Oh, sausages! <laughs> it's ducking every time it's swung around the ball. destroyed Roxy, but you won't stop me. Oh yeah? You made it to the boss level, but you won't win. Cause it's morphin time! Activate beast power! Huh. Nice. I'm gonna look epic in front of that building. There's a whole bunch of people in that building, right? They could have seen them do that. Beast. Granted, oh, and that apartment building across the way. Granted, they wouldn't know who they are. Oh, two of them. Oh, I like the screeching sound. Now, this part looks American, which makes sense. And then the other part definitely looks Sentai. Keep these bugs busy while I go turn on the transporters. Now to finish this plan. Yes. Right at the Morphex Tower. Perfect. Notice how he had to hold his hand up first and then do There. One more transporter, and we're ready. Rangers, two of the mega transporters have just been activated. If Blaze turns on the third transporter, he will take the tower. Copy that. Ben and Betty are taking the third transporter back to base. Hurry! Let's go! You're gonna teleport into the truck. I'll take that. Well, that was easy. Thanks for the delivery, suckers. Would that have been any easier for him? Squazzle, get ready. I'm about to activate the last transporter. Please! That'll do it. Oh no! Where to get that? You're gonna regret that! Try me! Transport! Santa Claus! Oh, oh he can still use the claws. He's got claws. 
There's like four of the rangers. Can any of them come over and help? Demorphed him. Order is activated. This tower belongs to Evox. No. Oh crap! Finally, the tower is ours. Dad. Dad. Holy crap. No, Devin. So they've lost a ranger and a tower. Rebuilding Scrozzle's cybergate from these pieces is our best bet to rescue Devin. I'll have all our technical departments gather in the hangar to reassemble it. So that's our plan? Just charge into Evox's base? You might be able to save Devin, but... But that snake has all the more facts he could ever want. Who knows what terrible thing he has planned? We have to save Devin. I am not losing another friend. Uh-oh. Uh, Roxy! What's happening? She's waking She's up. She's waking up. She's waking up? Roxy! Roxy. Hey. Don't try to talk. Wait, no, I, I have to. You need to listen to me carefully. What is it? My mind was connected to the evil Roxy. I saw what she saw. Heard what she heard. And I know what they're planning to do with the Morphex they've stolen. Scrozzle learned from Nate how to build a body for Evox. We're done! Your robot form is ready for you! That looks like crap. Transfer begin. Yes, Master Evox. That robot looks Beginning terrible. Beginning sequence now. <laughs> it's working. He's just watching. He can't do anything. When his new body is complete. Evox will be able to teleport back from the cyber dimension and destroy us all. If he does, he'll take over the morphine grid. No pressure. And this is all Rafi's fault, technically. Granted, we wouldn't even know this was going to happen if he hadn't saved Roxy. But. Basically, this is all his fault. So good on you, Ravi. All right, so let's see what we've got here. Just when you thought it couldn't get any worse as far as what Mayor Dad thinks of Devin, he finds out he's a Power Ranger. So that explains everything. So we should be good there, right? Meanwhile, we haven't seen Mayor Dad since that. He wasn't at the base with everyone. I would think he would be demanding answers. Maybe we'll see that next time. Uh, let's see. So, and then Scrozzle has built a terrible looking robot body. I'm assuming that once Evox is part of it, it'll get better. And they have a whole Morphex tower to provide him with the power he needs. Yeah, you can see how this is setting up for the finale. Now, the thing is, I am very interested to see how this one ends because, well, first, we, we still have the holidays, the Christmas special after that. And then we have a whole other season. I'm hoping that unlike the end of Dino Charge and Ninja Steel, this isn't set up like this is the end, and then they somehow have to get their powers back or something. So maybe it'll be some kind of a big cliffhanger thing. Ooh, that'd be cool. Okay, well, no, that wouldn't work. They can't do a cliffhanger if you're going to have a Christmas special. Hmm. Okay, well, anyway. 
We will find that out next time. In the meantime, you guys have a wonderful week, and uh, we'll have more Mighty Morphin Power Rangers on Tuesday, and then we'll be back here next Saturday for the finale. I'll see you then. Thank you for listening to Ranger Chronicles. Feedback for the show can be sent to prchronicles at gmail.com, or feel free to leave a comment at the show's posting at powerrangerchronicles.com. All images and music heard on the show are copyright their respective holders and are meant to help celebrate the Power Rangers. No infringement is intended. Power Rangers is copyright Hasbro Entertainment. This show is dedicated to all the men and women, both in front of the camera and behind the scenes, who have worked to bring us Power Rangers for over 25 years. Ranger Chronicles is a proud member of the Two True Freaks Internet Radio Network. Please be sure to stop by twotruefreaks.com to check out more great shows. Thanks again for listening, and good night.